be the whiskey or the midnight rain. Wow. Welcome to the Stagecoach Vlog! <laughs> Guys, we're actually in Coachella Valley for Stagecoach Festival. Like, what the actual heck? What the heck? So we are ready to go. We actually just stopped off for something to eat. So we're gonna get some food when we're in there, but it's literally 20 to two, so it's definitely yeah. lunchtime. Um, time's ticking. Time's ticking. So we got some coffees and then we just got some chicken nuggets and little chips to share. Whoa, this Whoa, that's is so a really cool. nice coffee. Is it? Yeah, really nice. We just got some iced vanilla lattes. Cheers. But mine is a large and um, it's giving extra, extra large. It's really nice though, isn't it? This is really nice. Really nice. Cheers. I mean, we've already had a coffee today, but yeah. there's no harm in having another one. Guys, I cannot believe we're actually here. It's like, I feel like when we've been speaking about it, and like looking forward to it, it's hard to like look forward to something that you don't even know. Like we don't even know what to expect. Even so. you've been to Ellie before, but even from Ellie, I don't really know what to expect mm -hmm. properly. But now I'm, I'm put them here and I put it somewhere. But yeah, I feel like we just keep saying to each other now, like, oh my god, like I can't believe that we're here, or like I can't believe that we're doing this. Literally, it's, it's literally like it's such a bucket list trip. Yeah. And there's no one I'd rather do it with than you. There's no one I'd rather do it with. Than oh, exactly. stop. Anyway, cheers to that. So we're gonna bring you guys along. This is day one of Stagecoach. So also, sorry, if you don't know us, we're from Scotland. A lot of like Scottish and UK girlies actually have never heard of Stagecoach, but I feel like... I think it's on the rise. Yeah. With, um, with um, country music just being like a bit more of a cool thing. The people that used to bully you for liking country are mm. now uh, big, big look home stands, mm -hmm. but that's fine. <laughs> um, it's fine, we're not mad. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely becoming more of like a known festival. Yeah, so we're just we're just out here trying to put it on the map, really. <laughs> so yeah, if you don't know, then we are. My name is Elle, and this is my sister Vic. And there's four years difference between us. She's actually younger, but mentally I feel like she's a bit older than me. <laughs> she keeps true. me right. She looks after me. We look after each other. Yeah, and we are here f all the way from Scotland for stagecoach, which is so fun. And we're so excited. So. We literally don't know what to expect. Obviously, I've watched a lot of like YouTube vlogs and stuff about Coachella and stagecoach and things. So I know what to expect in that sense, but obviously I've never been. So first mm -hmm. timers, cheers to that. Cheers to that. But yeah, come with us guys. We're going to bring you with us. And we're just manifesting the best day ever and the best weekend of our lives. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned. <laughs> guys, we're here. Stagecoach. <laughs> Sorry, it's literally so um, bright, I can't actually see anything. We're here! It's very overwhelming, there's a lot going on, but we're happy to be here. It's so hot. Cheers! I got my deodorant confiscated, I'm so sad. <laughs> literally, we could bring in like juice and water and all that. Like, we thought that we had to down it because, you know, like in Scotland, people aren't allowed in anywhere with drink because they just can't be trusted. Here, you're allowed to bring in whatever drink you want. But you're not allowed to bring in deodorant, so <laughs> let's hope that I'm not too smelly today. She has to hang about with me all day, so if I smell, <laughs> I'm sorry. We're gonna get something to eat and drink and then enjoy the music. I don't think the music's starting until like five. Yeah, it's gonna so be a it's long like day. Three o'clock just now. Yeah. Can't lie, the feet are starting to hurt already. <laughs> so that's not great, but we have brought sliders. There, we got a locker. Yeah. Um, we're not gonna talk about the fact the locker was a hundred dollars. But we're not going to talk about it. But we're not going to talk about it. We've got a good fight because we've got lockers, we've got sliders, we've got jackets for later when it gets cold, we've, we've got, got water, refreshments, SPF. I'm going to put up a good fight. Yeah, we're, we're in it for the long haul guys. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay, well let's put some sun cream on. It's so hot because we're literally in the middle of the desert. But yeah, we're so excited. So I think we're going to go get some to eat and drink and then we're going to go to the, uh, there's like a big barbecue. Is it Guy Ferrari? Like, Is that his name? I honestly don't know. I think he's like a famous barbecue man. Yeah. He's gonna do a big, a big smokehouse yeah. gig. Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna go see that and then watch the music around five o'clock. But yeah, so happy to be here. <laughs> ah! Guys, we're literally having the best time ever. So we're just looking at the set list here. So we're gonna go, to, we're gonna go to the honky tonk at five. So we're gonna go and see cheat codes, and then we're gonna dash up. We really, like, I really want to see Dasha and then I think we're going to go straight from there to, we'll leave there early to go to El King, she's an icon 
and then I think we're going to stay there, maybe get some food after this and then stay here all evening. Jelly Roll Air Church. Yeah. It's like, we are having the best time. We've We've met so many nice people already. Like yeah, everyone's so nice. Everyone is everyone is so complimentary of like our outfits. Like <laughs> we love America. <laughs> people are not like this at Transmit. Why at Transmit no one comes up to us and says that we look so gorgeous? Yeah, people are like, y'all are so beautiful. Y'all are so pretty. It's so nice. Oh, we should come here more often. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go and put my sliders on because the cowboy boots are just not giving comfort. You're doing well though. Mine are, yours have more of a heat. Yeah. She's she's gone for comfort. This is what happens when you buy 12 pink cowboy boots. <laughs> anyway, I did buy my I did buy some sliders from Walmart yesterday for $15. So I'm gonna go and put them on and then I can enjoy my night and I think we're gonna go and get I mean I said we were gonna get something to eat but I'm actually okay. Yeah. But there's so many options for food, literally like if I just read out some of these, it's like Mac Shack, chicken tenders and fries, fire wings. Make some barbecue. Hand dipped corn dogs. Hand dipped corn dogs. Tater tots, brisket and ribs. That's so funny. What corn was dogs. Fatty, fatty Mart? Yeah, there's a Fatty Mart. That sounds like a bar street. Oh, that sounds a bit of us. That's a bit of me. So we'll see. We'll see you guys at the Fatty Mart <laughs> in probably about an hour. <laughs> guys, we're back at the locker. We're going to get our sliders out because my feet, I think my, my boots have like a bit of a heel on them. So they're actually not that comfy, but my sister's are very comfy. Right, you're leaving your jacket. We also we also brought like, she brought a jacket and I brought a hoodie because apparently it gets so cold at night, like, because it's the desert. Um, like me and Smart were in Morocco in the, like a few months ago, and we're at like a barbecue dinner and it was roasting during the day. As soon as the sun goes down, in the desert it's freezing. So, oh, so this will be quite similar. Sorry, I'm just trying to get my boots off. It's not that bad. No. Oh, I feel so good to get these bits off. <laughs> no. Oh. Is it really bad? Could have painted them. <laughs> yeah, I know. My toenails are unpainted. That's the biggest ick I've ever seen in my life. No, I cannot see a thing. Might delete later. Um, yeah, we just hopped off for some food. So we stopped off at the little tacos and burritos stand. There's actually so much choice here. I'm very, very impressed. We're just going to talk you through what we got. I got taquitos. They look like this. <laughs> I've never had this in my life. I just heard someone else get it and I thought, it sounds like a good choice. Yeah. So that's what I got. Cheers. So cheers to that man that got these because now I have them. And I got a burrito. This is what it looks like. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm actually really looking forward to this. Are you? Are you quite hungry? Yeah, yeah. It's okay. We can eat. We're literally having the best time ever. Like I cannot believe we're here. I know I keep saying that to my sister. I'm like, can you believe we're we're here? And she's just like, yes. <laughs> Guys, we're back. <laughs> so sorry, I actually didn't sign off the vlog yesterday. We had the best day ever, like literally the best day. Stagecoach is everything we thought it would be and more. And it was so good. We saw El King, we saw Jelly Roll, we saw Diplo, and we saw the DJ sets and the honky tonk. That was so fun. And it was just the best day ever. We left about half nine and we, then we got home about half 10 by the time we actually got out by the time we got out of the car park and we stopped by and got some food on the way home. It was just the best day ever, but I literally, last night, as soon as my head hit the pillow, I was fast asleep. So that's why I didn't sign off the vlog. But anyway, I am gonna be vlogging today as well. Guys, you'll never guess where we're going. 
You will never guess where we're going. We have been invited to a pretty little thing. PLT gifting suite. Are you joking? Are you taking the mic? Because I don't know what's going on. Anyway, I'm not gonna question it. But anyway, I can't wait to vlog it. I'm gonna take you guys with me. This is such like a pinch me moment because I've literally been watching like YouTube videos about Coachella and Stagecoach and I've been watching the gifting suites for all these influencers on YouTube for years and never in my wildest dreams did I think that we would be going to one this year at Stagecoach. Like, I can't believe it. But anyway, let's go and see what it's all about. I don't know what to expect, but I guess that's all part of the fun, isn't it? So, yay, so excited. Guys, we're here. We found it. Um, so let's see, people are walking around with like loads of bags. So, and people are looking really cool as well. Yeah, people look really cool. People look really cool, so. Oh my God, look. Never gonna stop. <laughs> and I'm gonna vlog and I'm not gonna care what anyone thinks because we don't care. Okay guys, so we have left the PLT gifting suite event, which was so fun. <laughs> like I actually can't wait to tell you guys all about it, but we'll do a big debrief and like an unboxing tonight after the festival. But now we are now on our way to Stagecoach and we've actually just stopped off at McDonald's. Um, I know what you're thinking, oh, to get food, obviously, no. <laughs> to change, to change into our festival outfits, <laughs> to get ready for Stagecoach and McDonald's, but we're also gonna get some coffees as well. So it all works out in the end. But anyway, cause we've got now all this in the car and we've got now outfits that we were given at the gifting suite that we want to wear to Stagecoach. Mm. And there's no point going all the way back to the Airbnb to then come back, because we're literally right beside the festival. So yeah, let's go and get ready for Stagecoach. Yeah. Fit check. <laughs> you look so cute. The pink really suits you. I think it goes with the aesthetic. I mean, we're actually not the most overdressed here today. True. In this setting, we're Donald. underdressed. Yeah. Um, it's actually good. I think there's a... Yeah, so there's like a plum going on. Yeah, there's like a plum going on. There's a few kitty winks um, in their best gear. So we actually look pretty under this. Yeah. So we've got six nuggets. Well, actually, Vic's still waiting on her nuggets because they got the order wrong. No, I'm just so skinny. I just don't. <laughs> I just, uh, she's actually waiting on her salad coming. Um, so yeah, we've got nuggets, chips, and a lot of coffee. And then we'll be good to go. We're going to head over to the festival. So exciting. Cheers. <laughs> Hey guys, we've just come for some breakfast. This is day three. I've actually not been very good at vlogging, I feel, because I'm good during the day, and then when it gets to the end of the day, and stage coach is done, it's dark, and we're tired, and our feet hurt, and we need to get back to the car, and it's like a half hour walk back to the car, so I'm just on, I'm just on survival mode. I'm just trying to get back to the car and go to bed and get a shower because like it's such a long day. But anyway, we're now on day three. We're on the final day. So we've actually come out for breakfast this morning. I look like unwell, but I'm actually okay. It's just like, the, because you're in the desert all day, it's like you're breathing in so much dust. So I feel like I can feel it in my lungs. I can feel it in my throat. I can feel it in my eyes. I've probably got so much dust, dust in these eyelashes as well. 
like we're having the best time. So yeah, this is the last day, which is so sad, but yeah, we've just come for something to eat. I was saying this to Vic as well, like it'll be good to get actually like proper food in us as well. Like I feel like we've just been having like snacks and stuff over the last few days. So it'll be good to get a nice meal. So we've got some, we've got like a mixture of things coming, so I'll let you see what we've got. How are you feeling? Same way. Um, my lungs are really sore when because it's so dusty because we're in the middle of the desert when I now take a large breath in um, it does feel like there's a, a cage around my lungs constricting it <laughs> other, than other than that, that I'm thriving <laughs> let's go again thank you other than the acute pneumonia I'm thriving I'm ready to go thank you so much thank you so much thank you Okay, so we've got banana french toast. We're actually just going to share everything. So we've got banana french toast, some bacon, and then... what we thought was going on. No, it's not. What was it? Spanish... What? Migas. Spanish migas. What's the tortillas are in here. Ah, so it's like eggs mixed in with tortillas, Baked avocado. Tortillas. Yeah. And we've also got some potatoes coming. Guys, I also need to tell you, Vic, Met the love of her life last night. Yeah, I met the most <laughs> handsome man in Glendale. Fair enough to you. Yeah. Fair enough to you. Um, he was so polite as well. Oh, he's dead. Nah, that's my man. He was <laughs> dead talking nice, about dead. Dead. Oh, dead. Do we just go for nice boys? Do you know what I mean? Just go for nice boys. Oh, manners. Oh, manners. Well. Good old. Chivalrous. Nice. Chivalrous. No, it was so funny. Don't stop you. Uh, Oh my god, I swear this vlog is us just not knowing how to drive. But, um. I'm confused. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> anyway, no, it was so funny. I was like dancing with her, and she was like obviously facing me out into the. But she was facing like out into the crowd, and then she just like stopped in her tracks and was just like looking at me like. And I was like, oh my god, are you okay? Like, are you taking like a funny turn? I was like, what's wrong? Like, she just stopped. It was like really weird. And I was like, what? I was like, are you okay? And then I just turned around and like this guy was standing there and I, I knew fine well that was exactly her type to a T. And she, it was like, she was like, just in shock. Like this, he, it, it did look like he just walked out of like some Calvin Klein oh my God, yeah. photo shoot. Like, the gates of heaven. And then I just turned around and I was like, all oh, right, okay, I see what's happened here. I see. And then, um, he yeah, actually just came over and started chatting to you. And he just fell in love with me. And then he just fell in love and with me. Love, and then we were in love. And then we were in love. Happily ever after. To be fair though, he was trying to take you out for brunch today. He was. I said, oh, I've got brunch with my big sister. And then she went, no, it's a girl's trip, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fair. I was like, you can go. Like, I'm I'm fine. Like, she was like, no, no girl's trip. Girl's trip. Um, which is so cute, obviously. Well, it's now my love. When you get married? Um... Well, I said that you were getting married this year and he went, are you getting married this year? And I went, depends who's asking. <laughs> <laughs> For you? So bad. <laughs> yeah. Are you asking? <laughs> oh no, it was so funny because like, before he came over and spoke to you, mm. he like, I think he did it on purpose, but he kind of like bumped into you. Yeah. And then what did he say? But he was basically just like, oh, I'm sorry, like for bumping into you. And then I just, just so goofy. I'm just like, oh, it's okay, don't worry. Like, <laughs> and a wee Glasgow action, she yeah. went, that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> I just absolutely, peed my pants. And then she just turned around to be like, my chat is so bad. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he still, still fell in love with you, so it can't, still, be yeah, it can't be that bad. Yeah, it can't be that bad. Anyway, so that's a little update. Um, but yeah, so brunch was good. I feel like alive again. Yeah. I feel like we that's... needed coffee. Yeah. And yeah. we needed food. The coffee wasn't 10 out of 10. But... Yeah, the coffee wasn't hitting. Yeah. We literally went in and we asked for a nice latte. They say we don't do lattes, just cold brew. So I said, can we have some milk? And he was like, yeah, I can bring you over some milk. I was like, do you have any syrup? Some vanilla syrup? And he was like, we don't do syrup. And I said, okay. And I says, oh, do you have any oat milk? He says, no. Just so, and I was like, oh my God. What do you do? What do you have in here? You've just got coffee beans and a cow at the back and that's it. <laughs> and then he came over and we put like, with the coffees, we obviously put like Hunter's uh, stevia. Yeah. Like sweetener in it. And then he comes back and I go, oh, sorry. What's the Wi-Fi password? We don't have Wi-Fi, and I thought, well, well what do you? Have? Well, we're, we've committed now. <laughs> anyway, I'm not usually one for like wanting Wi-Fi when I'm out, but it's just because our phones don't work. Yeah. 
Out we here? Have to sit in silence for an hour. I mean, what do we talk about? We've spent a whole week with each other. Like, anyway, so yeah, so like the only time we can get Wi-Fi and actually communicate with anyone else but each other is when we've got Wi-Fi. Anyways, but we just we found things to talk about. It was actually not that bad, was it? We've got a lot more in common now that we're both in love as well. Yeah. <laughs> now we're both wiped up. <laughs> My camera died, so I love that for me. Like, I actually love that for me. Anyway, we're just waiting on Meg Maroney coming on. I'm actually very, very excited to watch her. So she's gonna come on, and then and another couple of people that we're really looking forward to seeing, and then Morgan Wallen's coming on tonight, which is so exciting. So we're actually just sitting in the shade just now because it's so hot, it's actually so warm. Like, this is by far the hottest day we've had at stagecoach so oh. we're just getting the shoes back on ready to lane dance for Megan Maroney coming out on stage it's a, it's a tough shift it is. don't let these cowboys and cowgirls fool you it's no. actually hard work. how do they do it they're sore like and full time not to be gross but my socks are actually wet <laughs> oh they look they look amazing they look <laughs> Very tickly. This cowgirl's got tickly feet. <laughs> yes. Anyway, guys, I know what you're thinking. How do they look glam all the time? How do they do it? But this is the reality. Watch YouTube. Like and subscribe to see the reality of uh, the glam. <laughs> Hey guys, I look very different. Um, that's because I am coming to you in the vlog from Glasgow, back in Glasgow, which, which is not the same aesthetic as California. But I just had to come on and round off the vlog because I actually forgot to do that when we were away. We were just honestly back to back. Like the trip was so booked and busy, which was obviously amazing and I wouldn't have it any other way, but I did sometimes forget to bring out my camera. So here we are <laughs> anyway i had the best time if you can't already tell me and my sister are like two peas in a pod and we just have the best time together and that trip was a trip of a lifetime and i'm so glad i filmed that vlog and i have that to look back on now because it was literally just the best so if you watched all the way to the end thank you so much if anyone's got any questions about stagecoach or just california in general then I'm your gal, so let me know. And stage close 2025, anyone? See you in the next one, guys.